Okay, so we're now approaching Gory Island. Now the story of Gory Island, and I'll, you know, I'm, of course I'm gonna get more information from our guide. This is where they held the slaves before they were actually sold uh, into slavery. So, I mean, for the most part, this was a large slave market. Uh, I mean, it's actually a beautiful island. And people to this day still live on this island. They said real estate here is pretty expensive and also very, very hard to come up, come by. And I can imagine why. I mean, I can see why. Uh, so again, this is the uh, where they held the slaves before they were actually sold into slavery to the uh, to the west. So of course they would have the auctions here. And again, like I said, my uh, my guide he'll actually give me more information on and go into detail about everything. So. We're here at Gory Island. And then also too, uh, when we go to the point of no return, we'll definitely pour some li libations for the ancestors. Uh, I'm just saying remembrance of them and to honor the ancestors. You know, cause at the end of the day, and I'll explain why I'll go into detail. There's the ancestors, they still live inside of you, inside of all of us. So everybody get off the ship and I'll make sure I, uh, get some detailed information on the actual island but this is Gory Island <laughs> all right we're on the island just got off the ship as you can see you can see the buildings the houses over here um, Abdul, do you know anything about the island? What? That's not, outside of what our um, our tour guide is going to tell us. Oh, here we go. Here goes our tour guide right here. <coughs> All right, you have to say hello to the camera. You have to say hello. Hello, man. <laughs> Your name again? Dynast Amir. Yes. So you welcome to Gori Island. Yes. You are at home. Yes, I am. Gori. Yes. Important place in Missouri. Yes, it is. Yeah. Hard place. But now it's paradise. Yes. Because everybody born here. Okay. But about 400 years the Africa sky in this island. Okay. That's freedom. Okay. By the white people. Right. Like Portuguese, Dutch, British, and French. Okay. So it's better for you to come visit this place. It's like pilgrimage for you. Yes. So again, welcome to Gore Island. Thank you. Your guide is like me, Isa. Yes. I'm a Isa. I'm here every day, every time. Talk about history. Yes. Okay. Well, let's go in. No, thank you. No, thank you. You have 500. 500, just interest ticket, 500. Okay. So, uh, uh, you welcome again to this place, Gore Island. Gore is like small in size because it's like 900 meters and 300 wide, but big in history. Right. About here, 400 years, the Africans cry in this place to different house of slaves to ask for freedom. Right. 20 million of slaves moved from this island and that, that slave came in general from the West Africa. Okay. They get go they only transit three months before they leave. Okay. Three months like men, women, and children. The first Europeans who uh, come to Gore Island is like the Portuguese. Uh -huh. The Portuguese, they are first to get Gore at 1444. Okay. And the Portuguese build the first house like a church and second house oh. like building is like a slave house. So they came, They first they built their churches. They, yeah, <laughs> to, 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 to talk about for like the missions, right? Like a, a, like a Catholic mission, right? And uh, 1536, so the Portuguese built another building around second building, like a right. house around the coast. Why? Uh. Because they try to keep slaves, put them sailing boat, and leave them. Right. I, I want to stop you for a second, Jomo Kenyatta, the uh, the great. Kenyan, the first president of Kenya, yeah. said when the missionaries came, they had the Bibles, and then the native Kenyans had the land, 
And then when they left, the, the, the native Kenyans had the Bibles and the missionaries had the land. Yeah. So it's like the same thing here. When the Portuguese came, the first thing they do is they introduce and indoctrinate everybody with their religion. And yeah. then they start with the slavery. They introduce our yeah. first one religions. But after <laughs> uh -huh. that religions broke. Right. Because they continue to keep Africans to sell them America. Right. Gore, that's why today we have Gore. Right. Gore, they are meaning only slaves place. Right. Slave trade. Right. That's why we have all buildings around. Right. Now we have thousand and five hundred people live here. But the old buildings they are built by the Europeans. Right. Why Europeans? Because they have a profit that time here. They keep brothers, Africans, sell them to America, right. get a lot of, lot of, lot of money, right. and come again, continue about 400 years. Right. That's why today we have a uh, Welcome. Right. Let's go to the house of okay. slaves. Okay. Uh. <laughs> yeah. So you understand about my English? Yeah, English is very good. It's very good. Right, and that's the thing, like in America, they're shooting us dead in the street, but then they'll criticize the human rights violations or so-called violations in North Korea and China, but then they'll kill black men in the street, they'll, they'll, um, they'll implement Ebola, you know, through Sierra Leone, Liberia, AIDS. and AIDS, Everything. you know, yeah, so, exactly, so they'll, they'll declare or, or start bio-warfare against us, you know, they've been giving us hell for the past 500 years. But they have the audacity to criticize another country about their human rights violations. You see, see? That's why it's hypocritical. I'm, I'm not feeling quite. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. Uh -huh. I'm sorry, but you know, how many years? More than six, seven hundred years uh -huh. together. So every day, the Africans stay same place. Right. Never move like Senegal. Right. We have, we, we, have, uh, we get independence at 1960. Right. By the French. Right. But we didn't. Get never profit. Every day is the same place. Right. Every day. So when the Chinese start to camp and somebody say, okay, friends, start to uh, help again to keep Senegal to give some uh, some profit. Right. Really, the white people don't want Africans. They don't want black. Right. Never, never. On life, they don't want black. Right. Because that is the mind of the white people. Uh huh. You see, but why they get everything from Africa? Everything. Everything. All the wealth. Africa. The resource, oil, everything, they come from here. Exactly. From Africa. Yes. That's why today it's better to keep this house, uh -huh. this island, you know, to show about the new generation. Yes. To know about the history. So in this place, 400 years ago. Right. 400 years. This is the first house, slave house. This is the first house? The Portuguese right. 1536. So as you can see, you guys, this is the first slave house. First slave house. Built by the Portuguese. Yeah, and you can Portuguese. see the big Christian cross right here. I want to yeah, zoom in on this. House now. I want to zoom in on this. Yeah, it's like the, the, the Catholic house. Right. Now. But I show you another one like the same. Uh -huh. Because before the Europeans have 28 houses like this one. Uh -huh. 28 slip houses around the coast. Uh -huh. They have a door behind. Uh -huh. I want to go there. I'm going to pour libations there for the ancestors no and all of the ancestors. Though, Absolutely. Meaning you come on, you, you okay. Like, you return. Right. Yeah, that's important for you. Why not? Uh huh. Yeah. No, no, no. No, so I say the first the first one is like Portuguese arrived here at 1444. Yes. The first navigator we call Dinis Diaz. And the Portuguese built the house over there like a church. Uh-huh. And second building, 1566. Okay. Slave house. Okay. At 1627, when the Dutch get here, five forty years, Dutch occupied this island and uh -huh. called this island Gore. Gore, okay. Gore. What does Gore mean? Meaning good harbor. Good, ha good yeah. harbor. Yeah. So after that, good, good harbor for them, yeah. but not for us. For them. <laughs> <laughs> and then British got here. Uh -huh. Then we get here, British uh -huh. at 1677. Oh, so the British got in on it too. Yeah. Okay. And the last nation is like French. Right. French. So about four nations 
please. Take a photo here. The European nation know this island, so that nation continue to fight for this island. They want here why? Because Gore is the best place geographically. Right. It's close in American coast. Right. That's why the European fight for this place. Right. Because when they say they want to leave from here, so they go straight to get to Brazilian coast. Brazil, Brazil, right. Yeah, and sell slaves. Right. From Brasilia, they get some tobacco and like uh, 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 and coffee. Right. Leave America. Right. Uh, sorry, Europe. Why are you checking? Why? Oh. Don't like that. You asked me before. But I'm not for you. It's not for me. Uh -huh. So, and the Europeans leave Europe, sell that tobacco and coffee, yes. and come again to Africa. That's why the slaves wait here about three months. Okay. Three months. Okay. And that three months, they wait for different sales. Very hard. Place. Okay. So around you have about the slaves. Uh -huh. This one symbolizes freedom. Freedom. Yes. Okay. Slaves at 1848. Right. By the French. Right. That's why this one meaning free the wife and husband together. Because time the slave day, sometimes the family get here, but the European they separate the family. Uh -huh. Sometimes they take father to the Cuba, the mother of Brasilia, wow. the children maybe Louisiana or Caribbean countries. Uh -huh. It's like totally separate. Yes. But that one symbolizes freedom. All right. That's why the wife <coughs> cross husband. Uh -huh. And the men say we can grow yes. together. And that information comes from this instrument. That one is like a drum. Um, okay. Symbolize communication in my country. Okay. It's like my telephone. Yeah, it's different to the beating to know about the message. Okay. Maybe we need to take one on. Why not? Together. With this camera. Okay. okay. Give it to me. It's more than You bow. Let's forget it, okay? Okay. Have you been to uh, Tanzania? No. This reminds me of Zanzibar. Yeah, Tanzania have also uh, Zanzibar. Land. Yeah, yeah. So Zanzibar, I think, was a big uh, slave slave port for the Arabs, the Arabs. So yeah, so it's a big slave trading island port for the Arabs. So best tour guide from the island. Yes. You. Yes. 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 Amadou Bamba. Oh, good. Yes. Oh, <laughs> welcome. Thank you. Thank you. You are with a nice man. Yes. God bless you. Uh -huh. Have a nice Thank you, man. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye, Pa. Bye, Pa. So this is a slave house. Okay. It's like a museum. You have five hundred. You have to leave five for no, 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 no. this place. All right. So we're here at the point of no return. So we will be pouring libations right here and honoring the ancestors. All right, go ahead. Yeah. So again, welcome to this house, like this slave house. This is my, my, yeah, my uh, uh, This is uh, about the curator. Okay. Okay, so welcome again in this place, slave house. This is the last one, the last slave house on the island built at 1776 uh -huh. by the French, yeah, okay. by the Dutch. The Dutch, okay. Yeah. In this place, sometimes 150 slaves wait here. Uh -huh. Men, women, and children. Okay. They wait here three months in a different place. Yeah, that one is like for, for me. Uh-huh. This one is like for the men, so we have about 15 to 20 slaves. Okay. Only men. 15 to 20. To 20. Wow. Stay down there, get chance. Yes. Sometimes ankles or uh, like a, a necklace. Right. And every day the masters come to ask a slave who wants to go to the toilet to give him freedom. It's only one time a day. Right. Sometimes they want again, but the master say no. And when they do toilet here, never mind, they stay here. But anyway, they don't get medical assistance. Right. Every day the slaves sick. But no medical assistance. So in general, the master they have they throw them out on the sea for sharks. Yes. That's why about 
uh, history say more than five to six million slaves die. The condition, even children, fifty percent about die. Wow! Wow! So three months. Sometimes they ask us. They ask us white people, Europeans. They say why? You can say no. Don't talk to anybody. You stay here, or if you don't want to stay in this house, I put you on the jail because they have bad cells around there. It's like a punish cells. All right. That's a jail, small one, very hard place. So when the cell would get gory, the masses come to take all men to get this house around because that time they have a scale over there and check power. Uh -huh. Because the minimum weight is about 60 kg. Okay. If they are not 60, so we put them around and they feed them giving beans, mix with uh, palm oil, make them stronger. Okay. Like animals. That's why the slaves don't get freedom. In general, they're not free. Every day they give you food like beans and then when the city will come, they put them inside, get what they can cost. Okay. Like this one. Wait them here. Only for weight. Before they have a scale here. Okay. Yeah, to check power. 60 that minimum. Okay. Sometimes somebody don't get 60. <coughs> they feed them, they feed them one more, two more. They have become small one. It's like a small man and Europeans say anyway, we give you freedom, but we stay on the island, we work for white people on life. Never go home. That's why some slaves get freedom but they stay on the island. How did the slaves end up on the island? They born here? How did the slaves arrived to the island. How did they get here? Yeah, they arrived here by the Europeans because the Europeans, okay. they go to the coast. Okay. Bring them here. Okay. Yeah, sometimes they organize kidnapping. Right. To keep Africans, put them the, on the boat and bring them here. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But if you ask the Europeans, the Europeans say, they, they, oh, no, they will say that we sold ourselves to slavery. Like yeah. the, the keys, the chiefs, African chiefs will sell us into slavery. That's not right. Oh, uh, no. I know. Good. That's, that's, that's what they do to try to justify slavery. <laughs> it's like sand for the men. This one is like for the children. Seven to twelve years children. Okay. Here. Okay. No medical assistance. Also like sand. Okay. Every day the muscle <coughs> engine touch about the boys to check the body temperature. Okay. When they see they throw them out for shots. Okay. So here, children not. Oh, you, when you say throw them out, I thought you were saying the shots. They throw them to the sharks. Yeah. Into the water. Yeah. Man, this beast. Go ahead. All slaves, when they sick, they throw them over there. Uh huh. So that's why the many die. Even here, the children have no clothes, nothing. Uh huh. So every day they come to touch that boys to check the the body temperature. Right. You see. So the the children here cry every day. Ask mama. They call mom. For the different language. Right. Mom on day, mom, mom, but Europeans say never mind. Right. They have done mind family. Right. For the Europeans, they are slaves, finished. When they say they camp, sometimes they separate them. Right. You see, that's why so many died here. Wow. Fifty percent. Wow. You good? Yes. This one is like for the girls, uh -huh. like young girls. Young girls, so only young girls get freedom sometimes because the value of that girls depend to the virginity and breast. Right. How the Europeans know the girls have virginity? So they come to touch the breast, uh -huh. to check how they're strong. If they're not strong, they mean the girls have no virginity. Right. Join ladies over there. Uh -huh. Because the girls, they are ex expensive four times like than uh, uh, ladies. Right. So here, sometimes the masters, they want the girls uh -huh. have virginity right. and to buy them. To buy them every day. Every day. The girls don't want. But you know, sometimes when they get pregnant, so the masters give them freedom. Right. Because they have a, they have, a, they have like children. It's like mulattoes, not children. That's why the girls 
have uh, freedom some time here for five or ten years. When the right. children go, so they can to separate them again and bring mother here. Take, put them uh, to the board and they leave America. Uh -huh. So that's meaning no freedom. You see, all the girls get that one sometime. While them every day, when they break, they get right. uh, free on the island. Right. Yeah. You understand me what I mean? Yes. Yeah. Temporarily sales. Temporarily, that meaning the men have about 40 kilograms or 50. Uh -huh. So they put them here and feed them even beans mixed with palm oil, make them stronger. Okay. That's one. We have that one, like temporary sales. Okay. This one is like a jail. Okay. Jail, I mean, in like punish. Somebody don't want sometimes. We okay. fight Europeans and European put them here. Okay. So it's better for you to get here like Nelson Mandela. Right. When they come to Gori, visit this place, they get inside, stay inside more than 10 minutes. Let me ask you this. That's the people, the slaves ever try to escape the island and swim back or swim to the coast? Or to Never. The they got okay. the sharks. They oh, okay. Out. Okay. I say every day they throw some. Uh, some uh, six slaves over there. Okay. That's why the sharks will turn around. There are many sharks. Never, never swim. Somebody jump sometime. One die. One shark eat them. Then go. Right. Yeah. Come on, Yeah. Okay. So that's why we have this one. Like okay. Punishment. Okay. This one too is punish. Okay. When the small one full for the man, so they put them here. This one is also J. That one is like for ladies, the ladies okay. and children, zero to six years children, okay. seven to twelve years of age. So that's why they are big. And ladies wait here also, same like other slaves. And when the boat came, sometimes they take ladies and fathers stay here. Uh huh. Children. Okay. Like it's a break. All right. Even here, every day they come to touch to check who's sick, who not. They are sick. Out. Uh -huh. Five to six million die. After wow. slave trade, so the European use again Africa. So let's oh. go up and Voilà, vous avez les commentaires dans la cour, hein? Par le conservateur. Allez-y. All right, guys, we're at the point of no return. Yeah, the point of no return. Wow. That's been for every three months they leave. After, I mean, this is it. Yeah. So basically, when the slaves were captured, and when they hopped on the boat, right. off they went, never coming back. Right. So this is like uh, the Europeans place uh, the masters live here. Okay. So you can imagine if you get this place, the masters live here, have everything, toilet and kitchen uh -huh. and down slaves. Okay. When children and women cry every day, condition smell, but they are never mind. Around we have some chains like this one. This one is like a necklace. Okay. And that one hand when the slave go to toilet, they join the hand for security. 
and but other one is like leg. Leg like ankles. Ankles. And the games, that's a European scam. Uh -huh. The Europeans bring this gun, give to African tribals, uh -huh. organized fighting. All right. Because Africans don't know guns. All right. The Africans don't know guns. All African leaders don't know guns. So the Europeans, they have to give this one to African tribals to organize fighting. Okay. That's why today we have this gun. Uh -huh. We call this one African's gun. It's African's gun because the Africans put some, some things like uh, to protect. Right. Yeah, it's like this one. But really, Africans, they don't know about the slave trade before. Right. They fight sometimes, some tribe of fight. Yeah, but it's only fight. It, but they don't keep borders to make them slaves. Right. Only Europeans bring slave trade on Africa. Right. That's why the history say, why uh, if when the Europeans stay in Europe, uh -huh. So the Africans don't know about slaves. All right. Yeah. So they can't keep my brother, take everything, resource, oil, diamond, everything. Uh -huh. Because after slave trade, when the slave trade ended at 1848, so the Europeans they continue to fight African tribals, right? Leaders, African tribal to keep everything. All right. And then some African leaders say no. That's why if you go to museum, if you go to, to ask about Senegal history, we have some names like uh, African leaders say no, fight Europeans. All right. We have about Alice Jata. This is a woman. Uh -huh. She died in Mali, like uh, Tombuktu. Okay. Because the Europeans, <coughs> when they report that ladies, she died in Tombuktu. We have Sheikh Ahmed Bamba. Yes. He's another leader. He said yes. no, we don't believe you, we don't know you. They don't want. It's also resistance. We have uh, Malamin Jami. We have Sheikh Maktai. Too many leaders. If you go to museum, go to history. Yes. So you get that man. See, you know this man? She said to send the two. Yeah, to send up a two. Right yeah. here. Right there. Toussaint he defeated Napoleon. Yeah. He defeated Napoleon. They they suppressed information in a, in American history books mm -hmm. because he. Uh, you have a black general that mm -hmm. defeated Napoleon. Right, right. So, Toussaint. Toussaint Elevator. Very, 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 very good resistant man. Uh huh. She died in France. Right, on, he was on yeah. exile. Yeah, on jail, like a uh, snow. Right. Yeah. The country that we call uh, for, for, for the, the Jew. For the Jew. She died in for the Jew. It's like four, but the place, we call that place Jew in France. Okay. When the European cap, uh, uh, keep this man, uh -huh. put them in jail in France, she died over there. Uh -huh. yeah, when the snow came, she gets thrown on the sails right. and she died. Right. Yeah. Right. I'm going to go on. Wow. I'm going to go on. 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 I'm So around we have uh, some things symbolized about history. I want it's like the condition for the slaves yes. on the 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 on the, on the, on the, on the boat. Uh -huh. You see, yeah. they put them like sergeants. Uh -huh. Yeah, like sergeants. So this is a kind that we use before the slaves. Yeah, we have some things here. Like this one. Sometimes uh, 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 gold and some silver inside. Okay. <coughs> That's for the materials. So this one is like African thing we call calabash. Uh -huh. So we use this one for many things. The music too, right? Music, yeah. heat, transport water, yes. and uh, yeah, like decoration. Sometimes in the house, put like yeah, decoration.
nós não com barco nem com tubarão. Vamos ir com 26 sal. Mana tu bana kau nombor yang tu bana? Ba, awe nak bana. See this is a small coast. Yes. But that kind is like an island. Uh huh. Island. We have a coast here. Behind was the coast. Right. So, uh, the world is like this around. Yeah, the slippery. So the slippery. We have to put the get small bark here. Right. And from the small bar, they go to sailing boat. Okay. The sailing boat stay there. And when they're full, they leave America. Okay. So every three months, they leave. Uh huh. Every three months. So sometimes the buyers and sellers be here. Sometimes they talk about for the strong, because they have to touch the slaves. Right. The strong. The strong men, they are expensive slaves. Right. They are best ones. Because they use the tall slaves, like the men and women, Make him re reproduction yes. on the plantation to get uh, strong and tall slaves. Right. Yeah, reproduction. And in general, they use some tribals like uh, from West Africa and uh, 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 tribals, West African tribals. They are strong. They are strong tribals like uh, from Nigeria. Right. Uh, some tribals we call uh, Yoruba, 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 and from Benin. Yeah, and also in Mali, we uh -huh. have another tribal we call Bambara. Uh -huh. Bambara, yeah. Bambara. I'm going, I'm going to Mali tomorrow. Yeah. Bambara, and they are tall, strong men. Uh -huh. Yeah, in Senegal. Yes. Yeah. Some, sometimes the Europeans use that tribals to make reproduction. Uh -huh. Oh, yes, 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 yes. All right, so we're here at um, Point of No Return on Gori Island in Senegal. Uh, let me make sure I'm zoomed out here. All right, there we go. Like I said, we're here at the Point of No Return on um, in Senegal. So I was gonna pour some libations just honoring the ancestors that, you know, were forced on a voyage to the Western, Western world. Uh, really by no choice so you know we definitely have to honor our ancestors I know especially in America I think we do a poor job as a whole and as far as remembering our ancestors that you know really suffered and went through hell you know to make it in the West and really build the foundation that we enjoy to this day they don't get enough credit so you know I definitely want to pour some libations um, you know, I'm very spiritual and I'm big on DNA, so by me coming back to the Cory Island to the point of no return, uh, the ancestors that are alive in me through DNA are actually making the return back home as well. And there's blessings for that. And that's why I encourage all African Americans to come back to Africa and at least visit. Because I mean, this is where you're from, this is your home. You know, even though I, like, I know you guys like that, like, you know, that, you know, we're not African and, you know, we're American, but especially in light of the events that recently happened as far as Mike Brown, Eric Gardner, you know, the system's making it clear that, you know, you have African or you have black, and you have everybody else and we're treated that way. So, um, like I said, I'm gonna pour some libations, uh, use, you know, speak, speak on some affirmations, you know, as I do it and, go from there. And as far as the DNA portion, I'll say this. So inside of you, you have DNA, right? If you take your DNA and stretch it, it'll go to the sun and back 70 times. And on in, the, in your DNA encoded is the DNA of all your ancestors as well. So everyone that you come from, their DNA is encoded in you, meaning that you really don't die because your predecessors or your ancestors are still alive inside of you. So like I said, by us coming back home, you know, your ancestors are actually returning back to the motherland for, for a return visit. So like I said, when they, made, when they made that journey 
to the new world, there is no coming back. That's why it's called the point of no return. So, you know, let's pour some libations and we'll go from there. All right, so we got solidarity, Ashe, peace, Ashe, return home, Ashe, love, Ashe, reunion, Ashe, family, Ashe, to the ancestors, Ashe, we're back home, Ashe. That's for the ancestors. Point of no return. Powerful. Take a look out there. Good video out here. Okay. All blessed time. Okay. She born here. Okay. Yeah, who, okay, who was born here one more time? The blessed Jack. Okay. Yeah, she's yeah. like the member of parliament. Okay. In France, the first Africans. Okay. Spain European Parliament of 1940. Okay. Come yeah. here. Come and show him, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, somebody do, uh, they did a special art, but somebody say that the technique come from the slave. Uh-huh. Because the slave, they have only fun on the sands. So okay. they stay down, they have to play sand. Right. So, these people do about sand painting art. Uh-huh. It's like natural sand from Senegal okay. and countries around. Okay. So, you open your camera, about one or two minutes to show about the they do about this art. Okay. Okay, here yeah, you can take photo is allowed if you want to take picture from So here we're using the natural sand from Senegal, from Mauritania, from okay. Spain, from Africa. Then uh, we have uh, the beach of Sali. The beach of Sali in the about 84 kilometers from Dakar. And this is the pink lake. I'm about the pink lake. The who? The pink lake. Yes, yes. Phenomenal like only in more in Senegal. And this is the beach of Cap Screen in Kazamas area, south of Senegal. The drone of Lompul. Lompul is about um, 180 miles from Dakar. And this is the Agriculture area. The yeah. Tenere Desert, the way it was passing the Rally Pari Dakar also. And we have the beach of Gore. Uh -huh. And this is local sand in Gore Island. Okay. Okay, this is the mangrove sand. You know the mangrove sand in Sin Salum Island. Mangrove, like the leaf of the palutivas mixed yeah. with sand gives this color. We have also yeah. the Sahara Desert in Mauritania. The Sahara Desert. Uh -huh. Okay, the iron mine in Kerb in Mauritania. The iron mine sand. Uh -huh. The black one is from the Mamel Volcano. Don't forget the, to take this movie just about near here. the Dakar Airport. Okay. The two. In all, we use them until 24 different colors of sand. So okay. Of just to clean them to move the dirt. As glue, we're using the sand from the Baba tree. Uh -huh. we mix it with Arabica. Okay. <laughs> A lot of artists make the design now. You will put the shadow. You will, you will make the shadow by the dark colors to the lightness. When you finish it, you, you will see the result. If the result is nice, you can give the hand coloring for him. This art comes from a school art in Dakar. You know, the first president of Senegal, Mr. Leopold Sedasen, was making a school art yes. in Senegal to helping the African artists. And this is original to Senegal is in Africa. We cannot impose him about the colors he have to use, only to use his self choice. One by one until finish it finally. <laughs> okay, if the result is beautiful, we give the hand color This This is not, we need to sort the glue on his face. <laughs> put the on okay. 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 No problem. <laughs> Huh? 
one by one until things is final. Give him the clothes about here. We finish it now by the light colors. We finish it now. Oh, that's beautiful. Wow. Nice. Hey, give him a hand clap. Go on the camera. Give him a hand clap. Make, make it straight. Uh -huh. You can't take further, no problem. Uh -huh. So, this is the result. And now, you have to put it on the song to dry it. Okay. Until 20 minutes, you have to pick it back to finish it. One by one until finish it. Okay. Right that's beautiful. So, nice. Now, you can take the result.